Hi Katie, it's Wednesday and here I go. It has started out simple enough. Have you ever wanted to do something so great that everyone will remember your name? Eternal glory and all that rot? Gellert was staring at Albus's ceiling, which was plain except for the light blue paint that covered the walls. Albus turned to look at him from his spot on the desk, fingers stained with ink from his homework. It was so stimulating to find an equal in another person. It was like the sun shining through the clouds on a rainy day, an instant path away from the darkness, and Albus liked it. Yes, he replied, glancing at Gellert to gauge what he was thinking. Why? Gellert smiled. That's the Albus I know, always asking why. Albus blushed, but it receded as soon as Gellert laid his eyes on him, face serious and tone husky and warm. Will you go with me? Gellert's eyes begged release that Albus didn't know how to give. Where? Wherever I go. Please, Albus. Promise me. Albus knew all about promises. He knew that his brother made one to his mother to take care of their sister and protect her. He knew his father promised his mother that he would be back some day, and he knew somewhere deep inside of him that these promises weren't kept. He made a vow, then, to always keep his promises, especially to Gellert, no matter what. So with his resolve hardened and a face set in stone, he told Gellert, I promise, as long as we are together. Hey, Grindelwald and Dumbledore, what's up? That took me a while to find a good enough one to share with you, but I thought it was appropriate since it was Grindelwald and Dumbledore. And you know how Dumbledore's gay and all, so... Actually, the camera's at 14 minutes and 45 seconds right now. It's gonna take a while to upload on the computer. In your next video, I want you to wear your Hogwarts house colors. For example... Ah! Hufflepuff all the way, baby! I really hope this video isn't dark, but if it is, then whatever. I'm sorry this isn't going to be very long. So Katie, I'll see you tomorrow!